Hi and welcome to Geek Beast. In this video, we're going to show you how you're going to set up your Geek Beast account. So as soon as you come to Geek Beast, you're going to put in your login details and click sign in. Once you're signed in, you're going to want to start filling the tokens that you need to get Geek Beast connected to your eBay account, your SKU Grid account, and everything else that needs to have Geek Beast work on your accounts. So first things first, you're going to go ahead and click on fill in eBay token. Now, in order to receive your token, you're just going to have to click this area right here on receive token. This will take you to your eBay account. And in this case, we're going to sign in and show you what you need to do inside. So once I sign in, I'm going to be able to get an access from eBay. Now that you have completed the eBay token, our next step is to connect our SKU Grid token, where this will talk with SKU Grid in order to make any necessary changes if the price increases or decreases on the supplier that you're drop shipping from so you don't miss out on any profits. So first things first is you go ahead and click on the SKU Grid token. This will give you uh, the location where you need to get your API token and this is inside your SKU Grid. So if we log in into SKU Grid, you then go to settings and then you go to remote API where you will generate a new key and grab this, copy it and come back into your SKU Grid account into your Geek Beast account and add the SKU Grid token here. Click save and you're good to go. Now in this case, you can also add the 15% uh, profit uh, to cover the costs and everything for the eBay fees, etc. This is the number that you put, whatever it is that you uh, feel is necessary. 